What's up guys? It's Zach here. I'm going to show you guys how to make a drink coaster for your drinks. Um, in our house we have uh, a certain kind of uh, tables that the wood, if you, it leaves watermarks. I don't know how the heck it does it, but it does it. So you take your regular Pringles can and you take the top off of it and there you go. Very, very simple. You can do it like that, or you can turn it over like that, but it's a less chance of it um, getting hit and falling over if you put it down like that. So it's kind of got walls, so if somebody hits it, it won't fall over. But in this case, like if somebody hits it, well, it's got a small wall to it, but if somebody hits it, it's a better chance of it getting knocked over. But there you go, here's my, I guess, life hack. And Pringles, before I go, if you're watching this Pringles company, or YouTube, people that own YouTube, tell Pringles to make it where this does not happen. My Pringles have uh, mixed up a little bit. Gone out of line. And if, don't even say it's my fault, because, I mean, really. Look, you need to handle it better. Not my fault. There's a hack where you can take a piece of paper and fold it in half. Stick it into the Pringles can and pull it out, and the chips come out. You can also just do this. And they come out very easy. But if you want your chips crunched, that's all you have to do. I didn't want mine crunched, but I did it for you guys. They still have a flavor to them, right? I hope so. Anyway, guys, that's how to make a drink coaster for your drink. Peace out. I see you guys later. Oh, selfie, selfie with the Pringles guy. Yay.